Welcome back to Civilization playthrough of the Canadian um, Civilization. Um, you'll notice that there is quite a bit of skip time between the last video and this video. Nothing really massive happened, so I'm deciding to post it off of YouTube. And there will be a link to watch the video off YouTube if you're interested. Um, I'm trying to remember if anything miraculous happened. Um, I guess one thing that happened is um, I produced communism and the labor union and those two the labor union produces the best defensive unit in the game called the mechanized infantry. Um, it's a decent attacking um, unit but not a great attacking unit um, and a the best like I said defensive unit in the game with a six um, so I'm going to build a few of those, especially as I attempt to conquer the city of um, I think Yellow Knife is the name of the Northwest Territory capital, um, and I want a rifleman's thirty turns, mechanized entries fifty turns. Um, and I could put this here and make it a little bit quicker. Um, how many turns will it need to grow? So I'll, I'll do that second. I have some people around there just in case. I can wake those settlers up to become my defensive units if I need them to. Um, so one thing that did happen the last time that we played is we have taken over again these two cities and my focus is to take over San Marcand and then hopefully sue for peace um, that should be enough I don't I'm not somebody that needs to take over the whole world um, I'll focus rather on building up my civilization and getting them stronger in other ways Let's see Ottawa is this where this settler's from? I will bring him over here, and I can't quite remember if there was a if there was a unit up here somewhere, a Greek attacking unit. So I'll keep him relatively close. There. So I'm not. I'm just not sure. All right, that was. I think a mistake move because it, it can't do anything over there. Um, I could, let's see, does it need more production? No, it needs to have mass transit so that it decreases the pollution that it might produce. So, do I have any? I have the great library being produced and a battleship. Let's see if I'm building any world wonders other than the great library. I want city advisor. City status. It's a great library and that's it. So the reason why I'm using that is you can use a caravan to hurry production of world wonders. And I haven't done that this game at all. Um, also never even felt the need to do that, which just shows that I've been relatively in first place the whole length of the game. Maybe not the, the extreme beginning, but that's about it. All right. Let's make our street a little, very nice. Polish up those stones. London builds mass transit, which means I can have it build a military unit. All right, one, two. I'm coming close. Okay, to 
Got a one, two, there. One, two, three, four. Stay there. St. John produced a rifleman, and it's also producing a little bit of pollution. Um, there's two pollutions, so basically if I take these two shields away and move them, there will be no pollution. It also means my mass transit will be built later, but that's okay. Fortified, keep him protected. Ooh. Why are they upset with us? What did I do to them? Hamilton built the Great Library, which serves no purpose other than to increase the score that I'm getting. Did they just build this? No. So I'm going to see if there's a... There is some units up here. So I'll wait for this guy to unload. Unload. Good job. Ottawa. Settler unit. And wait. Wait. <sighs> So I'm having some trees cut down near me, so if you hear some tree machines, you might hear them, you might not. I'll try to unload there, see how far I can get. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> that guy's dead. Greeks developed masonry. They are quite behind. I want to say masonry was one of my first or second civilization advances. Well, at least he took out one guy. One of my biggest challenges in this type of the game is not going to be enemies. It's going to be pollution. If you haven't noticed, that's been occurring far more re rapidly than anything else. I built something good. My gosh, that has been five, six. Okay, my gosh. All right, so I am going to, oops, I am going to buy a temple and then switch it to a mechanized infantry and buy that. And then see if I can bump into a guy and sue for peace. And that will end my war with the Mongols. I gave them a hundred bucks to go to war with the French. They won't. They usually don't. They say they will, but they never do. When I, I ask them to do those types of things. Let's see if there are any more up there. All right, so Montreal built a battleship. Um, hmm, maybe they'll search for the aliens. Montreal will search for aliens. Halifax built a tank. Mm 
surprised they haven't started producing pollution. Pollution, they have a lot of production. Hmm. Keep finding these Greek units up there, which is making me think they may be a city now. And I'm going to probably try to make one more defensive unit. Um, you were wondering why I bought a unit that produced more shields than I needed. And the answer is the temple is actually cheaper when uh, my government is a democracy than um, a, a rifleman is. So even though I was wasting a little production, it's basically just economics, as much of the world's decisions are these days. And I, I hear those tree cutters outside my window, which is good. I need, uh, you know, it's, it's the winter time where I am and if I don't have some trees cut, they can knock down power lines and wreak havoc. I'm going to build a courthouse to reduce some corruption so I can make more money. And I'm going to keep that armor unit there because it's prohibiting people from getting through. So the Greeks decided to build their city up here before I could build my city up here. <laughs> Was that this one's? No. Hmm. Okay, so I'll have you go up there. And you clean up the pollution. Actually, I'll have him clean up the pollution. So we're doing fairly well. My goal was to take over those three main Mongol cities, gain two world wonders. And um, again, that's mainly the only reason why I'm doing that is for civilization points towards the total of my score and now my next major military advance is advanced flight it produced, creates bombers which are great units and now I can basically do whatever I want genetic engineering I think that produces the cure for cancer <laughs> excuse me which is um, you know something that maybe in 1991 they assumed we would have been able to create. Maybe that was hopeful of them. Um, and maybe we'll get there someday. I tend to hope that. That would be good. All right, I'm going to move that phalanx up and then eventually disband him. Okay, I want to go this way. This takes quite a while, but like I said in previous videos, I like doing it manually because I can move this phalanx in one turn. And if you do it by go to, it will actually take, um, you know, several, well, probably would have taken eight or nine turns to do that if you just said go to a certain location. Moncton. I wonder if there's a city over there again. There usually is. They usually have a French city built over there. Or, I'm sorry, a Greek city built over there. Let's see. I'll have this is from Toronto. Toronto, have you traded with Paris? You have. Hmm. 